right? That's right. It's another Meals on Monday here on your Fox 21 Morning News. And our friends from the Carriage House Restaurant are here. Please say hello to General Manager Rob Moore and Chef Eric. Good morning. Good morning. You're located in Pueblo, right? We are. We're uh, uh, just south of Parkview Hospital on 15th and Grand. You've been around for a while? The restaurant has been in place for 30 years. 30 years? The so building, it has quite a history, huh? The building's been around for 120 years. My goodness. And we've been here for about six months. So what is <laughs> what's your specialty? Well, <clears throat> we specialize in um, uh, fine dining American cuisine. Okay. Uh, depending on lunch or dinner, uh, dinner time we just started introduced a prime rib that's amazing. Ooh. Um, and uh, we're introducing new sandwiches and salads for our summer lunch menu. This looks like total comfort food to me. Yes. Chef Eric, tell, tell us what you're going to be making right uh, now. I'm making the kolbasi sausage with cheesy grits. Ooh. Um, right now I'm uh, just sauteing some diced onions okay. and then I'll throw in the grits and some chicken stock and we'll let that For cook. people who aren't from the south, what are grits? <laughs> uh, it's, it's, it's corn basically, okay. but it's just kind of... It's kind of like hominy. It's kind of like okay. down like that. Okay. So, so it, it, it's kind of like that filler that just that kind of holds it all together. Right. Yeah. All right. Obviously, we have to kind of do this in TV time. So you start with the onions. Yep. What happens next? And then uh, what I'll do is I'm sauteing those in butter. Then I add a little bit of grits. This okay. Is about half so the grits so. go in right there. Okay. Mm -hmm. Fantastic. And then what I'll do is I'm going to add four cups of the stock and let this just kind of boil. Okay, and, and what kind of stock is this? Chicken stock. Uh, just a chicken stock, okay. Mm -hmm. So it comes to a boil, so it's kind of like rice. I mean, it has to, does it fluff up a little bit when it's... Yeah, it'll start to, to soak up all the liquid and everything like that. Okay, so while that's going, do you, what do you, what do, you do kind of in the meantime? <laughs> then what I'll be doing is, I'm gonna, I actually mark these off at the, oh. Oh, oops, that's these. for you. You can have I that one, Rob. Thanks. Okay. <laughs> I'll warm these up in the pan. Now is this kind of, what is this different? I mean, I, is this kind of like the one that I have for breakfast sometimes? I'll make from my, or is this a little bit of a different kind of a sausage? It's it's like a, it's a pork uh, uh, sausage. It's a Slovenian uh, pork sausage. You could have it for breakfast if you <laughs> wanted to. You could have it for dinner. It's is it mild or spicy? This has kind of a kind of a kick to it. Okay, so. I like the kick. So does this take a long time then to cook? No. And uh, what I did with these is I blanched them off in a little water ahead of time. That helps. And then I marked them off on the grill. I'll warm up in this pan and we'll add some uh, caramelized onions and roasted red peppers right. here in a little bit. Well, they're going to keep cooking. We're going to have the finished product coming up uh, for you in about 25 minutes as well, as well as learning about a unique event at the Carrot House, vintage cocktails and fashion. That sounds like something that's uh, fun. It's very exciting. Kind of different too. Definitely. We'll have all the details on that coming up. So uh, anyway, keep cooking. It smells fantastic. I can't wait to get the cheese and all the other goodness into there and the mustard adds a little more <laughs> extra spice. All